Uh, I got started as a writer, director, probably just watching movies as a kid and then uh, wanting to make films. Uh, grew up in Nashville. My dad made documentaries and I, pr I just, just followed him around as a kid. Carnivals and circuses. He would just make films about kind of strange characters, moonshiners, kids that ride bulls, you know, uh, just different different things. And I, I don't know, you grow up around, the, around that world and you, you know, kind of, I don't know, it becomes like what you know and I, it was exciting to me. And so when I, when I was in Nashville in high school, I started making films in, in, uh, in school and then probably went, moved to New York after high school and then went to school for writing for a little, for a little bit. And, and there I kind of, you just learn like, you know, essential basic things, formatting and stuff, three act structures, it was, you know, stuff like that. But mostly what I, mostly what I know about writing movies was just from other movies, watching other films, like pacing and different things, I just kind of, which would pick up on from just watching, you know, Buster Keaton movies or something. They always have, I just have lots of, I, sometimes it's so, so many ideas, it's hard to figure out what, you know, what it is exactly or, you know, where it's coming from or, you know, sometimes it's hard to tell which way's up or, you know, where you're at in life or, or what this dream means or what it's saying. I don't know, you know, it's, uh, you just get sometimes just pictures, just things, and then you just kind of make up characters and storylines that just feel a certain way and just invent it. If I, if if I have like a really hard time with something, I usually just scrap it. Just if it, if I really like if, it's, if I find it like something, if I'm smashing my head up against the wall too much is for a reason. It's just it's not meant to be. So I, I try not to struggle too much with it. I don't have like the end result in my mind when I start. I'm like trying to search for it. You know, I'm trying to make it up as I go trying to react to something. The movies are more about kind of energy or a kind of wildness or something that's like less defined, you know? Something that's more like magic or something. So I don't really go in like knowing. So usually when I'm at the end, even if it doesn't work, even if it's maybe some type of a mistake or a failure, at least I know it's interesting and then I, I went for it. Understanding what it's like to live a little bit outside the, uh, the common realm, <laughs> you know what I mean? Uh, and then know what it's like to experience extreme highs and lows. And you know, if you get locked up, you get locked up, fuck it, you, ha you have a story to tell. What advice I would give writer directors? I, you know, I would just say try to be great. Try to give extra, try to, you know, be bold. Try to invent your own reality. Try to, you know, do what's not been done before. I would just say don't even get started if you're gonna just try to do some mediocre shit because there's so much of that. Don't, don't do it just to make noise. There's too much noise. Give me something amazing. Give me something new. Give me something I haven't seen before in a way I haven't seen it. Let me feel something. Give me, uh, find some kind of magic. Go towards something that's inexplicable. Uh, Give it to me. Give me something that's aggressive and gnarly and chew up the world. Come at it from some other place. But just don't, don't give me the same shit over and over again because I don't want it.